Hello YouTube, it's your favorite Ninja Warrior again. I wanted to show you this. This is just crazy. Check this out. Okay, I uploaded this video yesterday. And within nine hours, it had 100 and 149 views. Okay, there's the views. 149. I think you can see that, 149 views. Let me pull this back a little way so you can see it better. I'm trying to do this upside down with my phone, so please forgive me. I uploaded this video. It is right now. See if you can see this watch. Probably not. Okay. This is what time it is right now, if you can see that. Okay. I uploaded this video less uh, about an hour ago let's see 10 10 18 so not even an hour ago yet and look already 60 views okay i think i'm becoming popular <laughs> i don't know um i just find it strange that i don't know i've got 84 subscribers now which is amazing i've had over uh uh, ten th or nine thousand views on my site so far. Um, I think it's pretty amazing that I'm already, you know, like I upload a video and bam, you know, 40, 50, 60 views within an hour. I think that's fantastic. It could be that it, it could very well be that, um, The doctors are, are using, you know, the doctors that are that are recommending my videos to their patients um, could very well. I know the one doctor down in uh, Boston is using my videos. Uh, anytime she gets patients in there, she uses my videos to uh, show the patients what they're going to go through right off the bat um, before she even pulls their teeth or anything. She does uh, consultations and lets them know what's going to happen. Um I think it's fantastic. Um, right now, I'm looking at the um, analytics. Now, the last time I looked at this, I was, I, I still had mostly, you know, I mean, the majority of men watching my videos. Right now, I'm at 65% males and 35% females, which is fantastic. Um, YouTube watch page is at 100%. So, in other words, everybody's watching it on YouTube and not other channels. 29% um, are watching it on YouTube channels. 23% of people have it in their playlists. So, that means they can, you know, certain videos in their playlists that they can watch over and over again. 21% um, of the views are from YouTube suggesting the videos to people that are looking up dentures and then uh, it says 27 percent other whatever that means um still actually now we've got i've got 83 percent united states viewers the last time i did this uh video like this i had more well it was it was roughly uh if i remember correctly it was pretty well split between uh the united states and the united kingdom and now it's 83 percent u.s um Still to this day, I've only, uh, just to prove a point here, you're not going to get rich making YouTube videos. Um, I've got 83 videos out there. I've had, you know, 25,000 minutes of watch time, four, you know. And uh, just to show you something, this is my estimated earnings off of the uh, ads right there. Okay. I've made a whole, what is that, eight bucks? <laughs> estimated earning of eight bucks eight bucks and change so you're not going to get rich off of the ads or, or doing videos on youtube the only way you're actually going to make money on youtube is if you have private sponsors and things like that which i don't uh, but i just wanted to show you that you know if you want to make videos to help people that's fantastic i think everybody that goes through a, a trying time in their life should do what they can to help others 
uh, get through it. And uh, I believe that it's, uh, you know, part of humanity. We should be doing that to help other people and to help each other if we can. Uh, that's the purpose of my videos is to help. Obviously, I, I'm showing to I'm showing you that even though they're putting ads on my videos, you know, it's been five months and I have, you know, my earnings are eight dollars. So obviously, you know, you can't live on eight dollars every five months. You know, it's not going to make you rich. But the point is, you know, a lot of people are putting videos out. Um, not about dentures, but about a bunch of other things. They're putting videos out and they're. Well, for example, I, I'm uh, part of an art site, and uh, one of the gentlemen that I watch on YouTube uh, shows you how to do uh, specific acrylic paintings and things like that, and uh, he's really good, and he's been doing it for quite a few years, and he makes his living off of YouTube by taking donations um, and by having people sponsor his channel, which is something I'm not really interested in. I did get an email from a company that wants me to partner with them. And uh, I have no idea what that's all about, but uh, I'm not going to partner with any company that wants to take control over my videos. And when I was reading the email, it was basically saying, you know, look, you can earn this much money. Um, you can do this, you can do that, but we have to be able to control the language and the sponsors and everything else on your videos. And I, you know, bullshit. This is real life. You're not going to edit my videos and you're not going to turn around and tell people, you know, you're not going to clean up my language or overlay my voice to make it sound like I'm saying something I'm not. No, I'm not giving control of that to anybody. My videos are real life and that's one of the reasons that I'm not making any money, I guess, because I'm not going to, I'm not going to play the game. In other words, I, I make a good enough living now. I don't need to make money off of YouTube. I don't need to play the game. So, uh, I just thought it was ironic that I posted a video on, you know, an hour ago and I already got 60 views on it. I just thought, you know, that's, that's actually amazing. Um, I'm getting a whole lot more comments now. I'm getting a lot more messages now. So apparently a lot more people are starting to, to watch my videos. And I think that's fantastic. I know that doctors are recommending my videos to people, which is phenomenal. I love that. Um, because I've done the process. I've gone through the entire, all the way up to present. It's been, you know, I'm in my fifth month and all the way up from the day I had my teeth pulled all the way up to present, there's a video journal. Um, anybody can follow my entire process, my ups and downs, the whole nine yards. And, you know, I just think that's fantastic that, that I'm getting a lot more views now. My two most popular videos out there, 439 views so far on Eating at Carl's Jr. And... 490 views on how to take care of your dentures when I take my teeth out and show you the cleaning process and the re-glue and the putting them back in and everything else. Those are my two most popular videos. So I guess people like the fact that I am wearing dentures and that I can eat the way I'm eating. Um, looking at the uh, analytics of the videos, um, most of the people that have the denture cleaning video in their playlist also have the eating at carl's jr in their playlist so it just goes to show you that that you know uh, they can show they're probably showing people look this guy does wear dentures and this is how he eats and that's great so you know my whole point with this uh, denture process was to try to prove to people to myself mainly to myself, not even to people, but mainly to myself that I can do anything with these dentures that you can do with real teeth. And I've proved that over the five month period. I don't think that there's at this point, anything I can't eat. I've eaten everything I, you know, and, and I know that it's, it, it, some of you are struggling with your dentures and it's going to take you a little bit longer. I pushed myself extremely hard. Um, but don't give up. 
don't quit. Don't be a quitter. Don't give up, okay? <laughs> Push yourselves a little bit harder. And, and I know it hurts. It does hurt. When you're trying to eat something and it hurts, you don't want to do it. But, you know, when you go to the gym and you work out and it hurts, you still go back the next day. So, you know, use that that incentive with your dentures. Use that same incentive, you know. It, you're trying to eat something, it hurts. Try it again tomorrow. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Repetition is what you need when you're trying to toughen up your gums and get your dentures to fit properly and work properly. It's repetition, repetition, repetition. Um, don't give up. Don't be a quitter. Don't stop. Just keep trying, keep trying, keep trying. Um, you know, and eventually you will succeed. You may not progress as fast as I did, and that's okay. You don't have to. You may progress faster than I have. And if you are, post some videos, please. <laughs> um, I think it's uh, it's all about determination. I mean, you're either determined uh, to be able to use these, you know, use your dentures as properly as possible and, and to look as normal as possible when you're eating, or you're not determined. Um, if you're determined to do it, I can inspire you to do it. But, you know, watching my videos will inspire you to try new things, to do new things. But that's all I can do is inspire. I cannot be there to force you to do it. I cannot be there to to tell you, you know, you're a pussy for giving up. I can't be there to tell you that you're a quitter and you should, you know. All I can do is try to inspire you and then it your determination takes over from there. And your determination determines what you can and can't do with your dentures. It's your determination. So... Anyway, I just wanted to show you this little quick clip here about how how many views I'm getting and how fast. Um, I think it's fantastic. Thank you all for watching. Um, please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. Save me in your playlists if you want. <laughs> um, you know, share my videos with people that you know are, are struggling. Share my videos. Um, that's... A big thing that I, I do with, uh, I get a lot of messages from females that I can't answer their questions. And I refer them over to Positive Beauty 528 um, because she's a female. She can answer questions that I can't answer. Um, as far as the, the, you know, certain things that females go through with dentures that men don't go through. Um, and, and, you know, like wearing makeup and lipstick and things like that. I can't answer those questions. I don't wear lipstick. <laughs> so I have to refer those over to somebody else. Um, so anyway, please, uh, by all means, um, hit the like and subscribe buttons. Don't be afraid to send me an email or a comment. And uh, I hope you all have a great day out there.